The 64% win rate Hecarim Demon. The first time I hit Challenger Twitch chat, I had a 65% win rate on Hecarim. Well, not the first time. The second time I challenged this season. This season, I will inflate my win rate in Masters. I will take my win rate from the 64% it's at right now, and I will bring it to 70. And it's like I will hit rank 1 Hecarim World, 70% win rate Challenger. And it's like I might just go on fucking 20 game win streaks back to back until I show all these fucking cocksuckers, all these motherfuckers who want to sit there and talk about how I'm washed or how I'm diamond or this or that. It's like, it's like we'll show them. And after we show NA again, I might go back to you and I might show EU. It's like we'll see what happens. Guys, I'm gonna be honest with you on versus a fucking player named Oh No No, it's Nunu. And it's like, how the fuck could I ever allow myself to lose this guy? I mean, Fuel loses lane for that though. Okay, well, honestly, we can program this Atros. I will still find a way to carry this game. To be honest, if we can just stop the bleeding top lane and Pure doesn't get more fed than Shodi, it's real, okay. Okay, I mean that's not bad. I get three kills, we secure a dragon, that's actually huge. Nice. We're back in it. Good. Get out. That's good. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. We are back in this game, guys. I'm not gonna lie to you. Aatrox is fed as fuck off the shutdown now, so he can hold top lane. I'm getting strong. Ball lane's winning. Mid's winning. We're chilling. I could kill Twitch easily here, can't I? There's no way, right? I could have smited so much better. Oh wait! I thought Renato would have had a revive thing. Nice. Not nice. Honestly, we're fine. No troll. And die. If he would have used his W, I could have like went in, but <gasps> okay. Nice. It's winnable. We are threatened by the now, so we jump to the past or the future. 
Perfect. Alright, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, the game is actually winnable now. I thought it was looking impossible, but Vlad dying means everything. If I could have gotten an auto and then gotten the EQ off, I'm pretty sure I would not actually. Okay, nice. That's actually fucking huge, by the way. Oh. Okay. Wait a second. Do they get Vlad? No, I don't think so. But he doesn't have ult, so I don't think in 1v5. That's huge. Why do you go water walking and stuff gathering the storm? Because the amount of power you get in the river is too much to give up, that's why. this game bro I need to just find like an opportunity where I can fucking mechanically stomp their heads that's here all I need to do I won't lie to you guys, I'm playing out of my fucking mind right now. I'm gonna be honest. Burn! Oh no, 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 Base, base, base! Base, 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 base! Okay. Aatrox out, Aatrox out. I'm back. I'm back. I'm ba guys. I'm being serious. I'm fucking back. <laughs> I'm being serious. I am back. I'm not trolling. Nah. <laughs> Dude, I'm. Guys, I'm being serious. Is the feeling back? I'm getting there, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm getting there. I'm starting to feel once again like if I just farm the game is over because i won v9 mechanically i'm starting to get that feeling back again that like i am the demon king mentality that play for me pl i am only playing for myself i am a fucking 1v9 warrior i'm starting to get that feeling back again and it's a feeling that i'm not gonna lie to you guys i haven't felt in months i've not felt this feeling in five months now i'm being serious but it's like i'm getting it back that like get me the three items and i will do the unthinkable i will like 1v9 in a way that nobody could have ever even imagined as possible for the champion i'm telling you guys i'm fucking back like i'm telling you guys when i say look at this look at this this is where we decided to say fuck it we try out a new build i will make this champion perma ban in na again mark my words Trust me when I tell you guys this. Right now, look at Hecram's ban rate master plus 0.6%. Look at it. Clip this right now. I'll mute the music in case. Look at this. Clip this right now. On July 14th, Hecram's ban rate is 0.6%. 
Save this clip somewhere. I don't care where you put it. I promise you, I will get to Challenger by next patch on Hecarim doing this new build. And I promise you, I will make Hecarim's ban rate 20 times what it is right now. Watch, 20, 30, 40, 50 times. Watch. You guys are going to see, I will make this champion permaban in NA again. Single-handedly. It's like NA isn't ready for my return.